Hello, welcome to Washo Nevada, and this is video 12. Um, I can't remember where I said at the end of the last one, but my header has disappeared. Yeah, I parked it here, and while I was up trying to find, uh, I, I said I'd stop and look see if I could find UFOs, didn't see any, come back, parked up the truck and trailer over here, and on the way in, couldn't see the header. So, then I walked around and I noticed it's here. So, um, no idea how it got there, but it seems to be in the woods. So, well, the enemy I can think of is it was moved by aliens um, or somebody's playing a prank on me. So, anyway, let's um, get in the uh, pickup and um, see if we can get our header out of the trees um, yeah quite well placed I suppose it would be easier just to cut down the trees but I'd like to try and keep the trees there if possible header retrieved from the trees I am now going to put it this side and see what happens so we'll leave that there I've had a look and um, the only thing we really need to do at the moment is fertilize this bottom field I think it's on another another growing state and the two fields at the top but there's the, the old section of the grass field is ready to mow I don't really want to mow it yet because <clears throat> then it'll be it'll always be off on the whole grow state the whole field so I'm going to leave it and wait until the other one catches up and then we'll be good to go there is a fertilizing job on field three quite a large one but we've got a reasonable size fertilized spreader so I'm going to run up there in the Stara is it Stara? yeah Stara whatever uh, and we're going to have a look, see what we've got uh, fertilizer wise inside it. I don't think we've got any. I think we used it all up. There might be some left if there is. Um, I'm going to run over the grass field first, and then we may have to look at um, either buying some or taking it down to the multi buy point and get some more uh, liquid fertilizer. So that's not a problem. Um, while we're here, we can. Well, there's not a lot we can do. We need to get bits if we need to sort them out. But hopefully, the chickens and the horses are doing well. The pallets are back in with the chickens. I do need to get another one there. You can see the different growing states of the grass there. So let's hitch onto this. I'm hoping this will be able to run this. It should be. Yeah, it should. Yeah, no, of course it is. It's what I bought it for. That's why it's got crop tyres. Um, let's open her up. Well, I'm going to leave that like that because it's moved again. Look. The trailer has moved again. How weird is that? I literally have not moved that. That trailer has moved again. I put it the other side of the truck. All right, we'll leave that there. I'm, I'm not going to touch that. We're going to leave that there. Right, I'll leave that attached to that. Nice. There we go. So they should be on maximum fertilization now, so we should get some good yield off those. The grass comes out, we've got to mow that, turn it, turn it into hay, that's good for the horses. Um, then we can get some straw. <coughs> Don't know whether to bail them or not, bail them or not, or um <coughs> excuse me, or just leave them as I suppose it doesn't really matter, does it? Let's get this open.
Right, let's try and GPS again. So, Alt E, Alt E, there we go. So, let's get that down. There we go. Just missing that edge, but you know what? I'll just run up the middle. I don't mind if it's a little bit off the edge. It's not done. Um, we're not going to run out of liquid fertilizer anyway should be enough for it Yeah, there's a little bit of each side. I need to expand both sides. If I expand both sides, it's probably going to be a triple run, which would be a lot better. So, uh, yeah. Um, once this is done, um, I'm going to go and do a couple of um, the fuel run and just get some. Actually, do I need to do one? I'll check, see if they need fuel. They may not need fuel. If not, we won't worry about it. Right, fill up the <coughs> sprayer here and uh, go off and do a couple of fertilizing jobs, bring some money in. Um, actually, let's check on. That's what we need hay and straw. We need to get a bale of each just so that the um, horses have got something. So. Not that, let's put that away. Right, all loaded. Uh, ended up going with two bales of each, two hay, two straw. Got another egg pallet and all on unloaded and ready to go. So back up to the farm. We'll unload these, uh, the pallet for the chickens and then the hay and the straw for the horses. So we'll, uh, they'll, they'll all be good. They'll have everything. Hopefully by the time they run out, my fields would have matured, I would have harvested them and I would have uh, had some hay and I would have had some, get some straw and I'll have it in storage. So that's saving me have to buy any more, which is the whole point trying to be self-sufficient. Um, when we harvest this field, I'm definitely going to expand this field. Um, well, well, that forklift on the back, and I'll make this trailer a bit more swinging around on the back end doesn't it yeah almost got a bit of drift in there <laughs> so anyway chickens don't seem to be as productive as they were before what i am going to do i'm going to take this through to this side actually uh you know what let's just do that there for the moment Jump out, I can leave that running. So I'm literally gonna chuck this off. Right, so um, after my quick break, um, I have filled up the sprayer. We are over at field three. We're doing the contract. I've set up the GPS, as you can see, and we're on cruise and we're just basically kicking it out we're gonna cruise for this we'll earn the 41,000 and um, I will come back at the end of doing this um, probably gonna have to fill up halfway through we'll wait and see um, but I think on this field this size I'm definitely gonna probably need to 
do another tank if not three but we'll wait and see that's uh yeah it's not not too much of a problem so until then um i'll speak to you in a bit Right, we are at 70 odd percent, so we're not far off. This unfold, we've got just a little bit to do, we've got more than enough. Let's put the sprayer down. There we go. Okay. Let's have a quick look. We've got 25% left to go. It shouldn't be very many runs. So uh, we'll be back once we've uh, once we complete or we're on the last little bit. So see you in a second. Okay, we are nearly done. It's uh, I've been doing it a one one time, so I've been going quite a while. But we've almost done the whole lot. It's showing well, we're in 99 cents, so we're not going to need to get to the end. And I'm not going to go all the way to the end. I'm going to get the completed, and then I'm going to keep. So I want to keep my new fertilizer um, for when I need it. So just wait for that to click over, uh, completed job, and we will then be job done any moment now and there we go and we actually haven't used yeah we did one and nearly 30 percent so yeah 31 percent that ain't too bad so let's take that off and we'll make our way back that's it, turn that off. So, we've done all right. That's uh, that's another 41. That should take us back up. Uh, and we've still got 30. Uh, still got 70% pick of fertilizer. It's just 70% there, and that's just 69 there. So, we're, we're right on the cusp. So, uh, yeah. Let's see what we can do next. Um, Chickens have still got a fair while till they're going to have filled up their, let's turn those off, filled up their, uh, brain's gone, oh, I want to go down there, oh no we didn't, we wanted to go down the next one, but perhaps we'll do, we actually need to check, whoa, that was a bit tight because it was a drop. I think what we might need to do is get some uh, lime because we keep buying it and it's free down there and we've got a trailer and I think what we need to do is get a front loader bucket on one of the tractors on one of the tractors on the only tractor that will have one and take the trailer down and we'll get a trailer of lime I think for free so all we've got to do is pay out for a front loader and a bucket so let's put let's plonk this in and uh, there we go <laughs> 
Nice. Done. Beams off and we're out. Right, so I'm going to go and sort out the case because that's the only one that will take um, a front loader. Hopefully, we should be able to load that on the back for when we're loading. So I will be back shortly and uh, we'll have a front loader on the case. Right, um, still up at the store, um, was messing around, was looking at getting a bigger trailer, didn't bother, um, realised that the case couldn't do a front loader, it's just there, but that was over there and I really couldn't be bothered to mess around, and I thought, you know what, I'm going to get a new, new tractor, I'll replace it, so I've replaced it with a case maximum, and I've gone with a 145, I've done a, done it in like a, burgundy red with black wheels knock on tyres and then the front loader I've kept the original weight and the original trailer so now we're going to go off and get some lines so I'll see you down at the quarry right <coughs> 81 percent that'll do we are struggling a bit with weight now um, 17,200 litres of the line and then the weight on the front with a bucket in there. Excuse me, we had the weight though, because if we didn't have the weight, we would have never been able to uh, pick the line up. So, set the cruise and get back to the farm. Right, now we've got to find the line storage, aren't we? To uh, <coughs> sort of the blanks, because you don't seem to be being as efficient. I think this one's the blind one, isn't it? Yes. So we're gonna unload here. So it's in line and storage. Don't know how long that will last, but <coughs> we have some line there. Okay, we're jumping around a bit at the moment, and um, back down at the main yard at the moment. <coughs> Just been checking out a few bits and pieces. I uh, have noticed that the uh, grass field at the top is actually ready for mowing. Um, it's not completely at full. A growth state all the way through, but one lot is on full and the rest of it is on the entry level. So we're going to take a run up to there, grabbing a mower. Uh, we're going to mow it and then I think we're going to ted it over because I want to make hay because hay would be good, I think, for the horses. So yeah, that's what we're going to do at the moment. Um, I'm going to run up to the grass field. I'll see you there in a minute. We're, uh, we're up there and we are going to start mowing on the new grass field and that will get it back to original state so let's uh, run one
Okay, which which right. And then we need to move it over. Nice and neat road, um, but we need to uh, probably tip this so I'm going to probably have to convert it to hay. So I'm going to crack on with this and uh, I'll be back once we are complete with it all done. So see you in a bit. <coughs> okay, we're up the field, he's still mowing. I've got a hard work on mowing. I'm going to tip the grass because I want to turn it to hay. Uh, what I have decided is I think I'm going to move the horse pasture. I'm going to make this a big square field. I can take it wider. I can get rid of that shelter. I think I'm probably going to move the horses down into the bottom yard. But I've got that, all that empty space. So I'm going to get a new yard built down there. I'm going to move all the horses down there. And we'll transfer all the um, feed and grain and everything down there as well. So that's... Um, start taking the grass We can three of their rows. So when we get this one done, they're gonna go up and get that bit on miss and then we will And I'm making a mess of it there, but we've got a wing row. We can start again with a wing row, and uh, I need to just make sure I get all of it. But I want to open this field right up and get bits I've missed, and um, just it'll be uh, neater. <coughs> Try and square the corners off. There we go. That's better. and square this whole field off make it look nice Get, so that that will be on the, that's, that's our big plan is now to uh, oh wow so I might need to have to buy some egg because I'm going to lose grass otherwise because it's not picking it up where it comes out of the field I'm going to have to convert the edge of the field back so that there's uh, an overrun so I'm going to lose that every day otherwise. Or every time I mow. This is not good. Over there I'm going to have to mow side, uh, cross and not up and down. Which may be the way. Yeah, and then I won't drive into there as well. Because I'm just going to end up losing stuff otherwise. Right, let's uh, pick that up. 
turn it off and fold it for the moment. I'm sort of at the bottom of the yard then really, haven't I? So, right. Okay, right. I'm losing some there on the field, so I need to alter that. Um, this looks good. Let's see what loan we can take to move the. Actually, we shouldn't have to do it. We'll do a fuel run. We'll do a double fuel run. I'm trying to move Where am I, little helper there? Okay. I don't really think so weird, but we let me, uh... Yeah, alright.
You know, Cheddar can go away. Or they yeah, they took. And then we go back to Wimrow. Okay, right, <clears throat> just to give you a heads up, we've uh, mowed the grass, it's not done, uh, it's not brilliant, tethered it, so it's turned over. Tomorrow we'll we row it, we'll collect it, we'll either bale it, or we will uh, just collect it and store it, so in the hay, hay bales, or just bulk hay, put it in storage. Um, I'm going to do a fuel run in the morning, I've exchanged a fuel trader for a, a trader that's got double capacity because uh, I want to build a new horse uh, paddock down the bottom uh, in the main yard uh, there's a load of wasted area there we can put that down there we can sell this one or, or deconstruct this one expand the grass field we'll take an edge out at the end now where it's not allowing me to cut because I'm right on my border so we'll bring that back a bit we'll take it right out to the trees on that side there may even just take those trees out um, stuff kind of and really come to it. Uh, the metal shed I may move up that end. Uh, we'll move that and we can bring the grass almost all the way out to here. I want to make this grass pasture as big as physically possible. Um, because what I'm going to do is look at doing grass hay and silage because we can do them silage bales as well. So that is <coughs> the plan for up here and down the bottom. I have got a wind row down the bottom, I have them all delivered down the bottom. Uh, this will be a lot of the yard tied in. I'll drop this and we'll go down the bottom and show you. And then that's going to be it for this video. Uh, sorry for that delay, it's been a bit coming. Um, I have been uh, doing Flint of Forest and uh, um, trying to get a couple of problems. As you will have seen with the last one, well, you'll see with again this one, I had a walking head our walking header um, so let's drop that and then let's get down to the bottom to pick up the windrow sorry sound went a bit black there um, I had a bit of a coughing bit sorry about that um, yeah so as I was saying I'm going to uh, I'm happy with the yard the way it is. Um, we got rid of the barn because it was pointless. So we've got this great big area here, which we could put the horse paddock here. More than enough room. Keep it all centralized. Uh, this is the new trailer for diesel fuel. Uh, does a lot more stuff. Uh, the yard is a mess. So I'm gonna put the case on the windrow ready for the morning for the uh, probably get hired worker to do that but we want to see uh, we'll put the trailer on the back of the Kenworth because that should be able to tow that one not a problem so let's leave that one there jump out of that and then the other trailer Can be picked up with the stair. So anyway, I'm going to finish um, tidying the yard, getting it ready for a uh, new horse stables. But we've got to do a fuel run in the morning to try and get some money in. We are low. I had to take another loan to be able to afford to this after selling the other one because it wasn't work as much as this one. So until next time, thank you for watching, and we'll catch you again tomorrow. So see you again soon. Bye.